Hello everyone and welcome to a special celebration video and this time you can see I reached finally reached during the night 30k subscribers and 5 million views I don't know where you where can you see the views let's go to my channel and let's click that the video is might be a bit long I don't know if it's gonna be long but you can see in the top over here 5 million more than 5 million views already and that's amazing i wanted to thank you guys thank thanks everyone for subscribing for watching my video for all of the support you're giving and this is a very exciting day not only i reached the 30k subs and those 5 million views there are also going to be sneak peeks starting today and it's gonna be about two weeks and in two weeks the new update is gonna be released from what I from what I heard it's gonna be a crazy update with new defense new new town hall town hall 11 and obviously probably new levels of troops maybe new troops as well a new hero by the way so that's that's definitely something exciting and I'm excited twice excited because of what's going on so at the end of the video, I'm going to do a giveaway of two cards, one iTunes card of $10 and one and one Google Play card of $10. So just wait for the end of the video. Hopefully it's not going to be long. I'm going to be answering all the questions that you asked. And if you want to get updated about giveaways and stuff like that, about, about videos that I'm posting, just follow me on Twitter. You can see it over here. It's Gary with that... With that line, I don't know how it's called, Gaddy HH, you'll find me, just Google it or something, you're gonna find me as you can see. Even Daddy himself congratulated me on Twitter for reaching 30k subscribers. So basically, if you wanna follow me, you can do that on Twitter. It's very easy doing that. So what I'm what I'm gonna do is going to that video, you can see my YouTube, you can see how it looks like, how it works and stuff like that and i'm gonna go to that video where i asked you guys to ask me questions i don't want to run the video it's not it's not what interests me but what does interest me is your questions and i'm gonna i'm gonna be answering them at least most of them and some are gonna be some are gonna be probably funny i don't know i didn't look at all of the questions but i'm gonna look at them now so before that, I didn't notice, I forgot that I asked you to ask questions and wait for it for this video, and I answered some of them, so I'm pretty dumb, so that happened. Anyway, I'm gonna answer them on the video as well. So, will we be continuing with the 3 star base layout series on popular bases? If you don't know what it's talking about, it's the base beat section on the website. Let's go to some new tab. So to get to the base beat section, I'm just gonna say it in few seconds. All you have to do is go to my website. It's www.gadihh.com. Then you gotta go to the base beat section. You can see all the pages over here. And over there, I'm showing how to beat the popular internet bases. All you have to do is scroll down. That's on, on, a, on a laptop and you can surf on it on your phone or your tablet or, or whatever you want. And there are lots of videos over here with attacks on known internet bases there are lots of pages over here you can just go and see all the bases over here and see how to beat them for three stars so by the way i wanted to ask something about it if you guys want me to put more videos of other youtubers beating internet bases just let me know and i might do that i'm, I'm really considering doing that although it's not with me explaining how to do that and I cannot take any responsibility for what others do. I can put links of other YouTubers and maybe you can submit your videos as well. I mean, we're gonna see how, how we can do that. If you think I should do that, just let me know in the comments under this video and we're gonna do that. So am I gonna be continuing doing videos for those? Definitely, I really like those series. I know it helps a lot of people. I'm getting emails and on contact forms on the website daily daily of people thanking me for all those videos on the on the website and i know that many find it useful and i'm definitely going to continue that so 
I already answered, I'm adding new videos and bases whenever possible, whenever you guys post, whenever I meet internet bases and we beat them, I'm adding those to the base beat section, so just go check it. Can you show more 3 stars using Valks? Of course, my clan are using a lot of Valks in their attacks. A lot of Valks in their attacks, that doesn't sound, that doesn't make any sense. My clan are making a lot of attacks with, with Valks, that's what I mean. And I'm definitely going to show you more and more of those. I know that people like Valk attacks, I really like them my, myself as well. And I'm gonna show more of them whenever it's possible. By the way, if you notice the latest videos, I made two live attacks with Valkyries. It was the first use by me of Valkyries and it was amazing. I got 99% on the first one and 3 stars on the second one. So they're amazing and you should use them as well. Are you gonna make a clan for yourself? I'm a big fan. So first of all, thank you for being a big fan, but we already have a clan. I mean, we're running three clans right now. We're running the Feeder Clan, CW Bootcamp, and you can try out over there if you meet the minimum requirements. And we're running Winter, Winter Never Came, which is a very strong clan, and it runs very well. And of course, GS96, it's in the top war clans list, and this is another clan that we run. Each clan got different properties and different goals and are ran in different ways but those are the three clans that we run and that that should answer your questions so what clash of clans update was the best in your opinion so there were many updates and i'm not sure i remember all of them but i think that definitely that when they added the clan wars it was the most amazing update I started my YouTube channel shortly after it and basically that, that that's the reason I'm still playing or watching this game. I don't know, I'm barely playing in the last in the last time because I barely have time for that. Just running YouTube and the website and studies and work and everything just takes a lot of time and I'm having troubles playing but Clan Wars was definitely what made me continue with this game probably without it i would get bored from farming and stuff like that not saying that farming is boring but i don't know for me it is and i would definitely quit the game so congrats congrats on almost 30k now it's already more than 30k so let's go to the next question what troop is your favorite to see in three stars not based off how good it is but more on creativeness and fun so you probably know that i was one of the first maybe the first showing complicated level union attacks on my channel it was a long time ago something like a year ago maybe more and that was definitely my favorite troop and it's still like that i still like the balloon attacks and the lava hound attacks it's still the same even before the lava hound came out I was doing three stars on Town Hall 9s with balloons only. So if you watch my old old videos, if you go back in the videos and watch them, you're gonna see balloon attacks without lava hounds, three starring Town Hall 9s. I mean, maybe the not all of them were maxed and stuff like that, but it was definitely possible. And I was doing those stuff, and it's really fun. So that's definitely my favorite troops. And I also like watching Valkyrie attacks. So those are definitely my favorite too so next question can you do a video about level 2 golems and low heroes goho so we don't really have people with level 2 golems because we're trying accepting people with max troops because it's very essential if you want to attack high level bases but if people post on bindle and i'm going to talk about it at the end of the video with the giveaways and stuff like that if people are going to post attacks of, of good attacks of three stars with level two golems and low heroes then sure i don't mind coming to your clan and recording that so if you got attacks that you want to show to the community for example to this guy tyler and you really want to share it on my channel just go and bundle join it and post a photo of your attack and i'm gonna come to your clan and record it so that's basically it 
Can you make more videos like the one about Clashcon, the Egyptian one? If not, is it hard to make them? So if you don't know what he's talking about, so all you have to do is go on YouTube and search that. This is exactly that video and it's it's kind of a joke on the Clashcon and people found it really funny. You can see a lot of likes on this one and seems like a lot of people like that. So lots of comments as well. You can see it over here. Nice, very nice. LMFAO. Whoa, he's gonna make a coronary. <laughs> Even daddy. Even Daddy himself posted a comment on the video, so I'm very excited that he done that. And he got many likes as well. No words to say, totally, ha ha ha. Oh my god, ha ha. So people found it funny, so if you want to watch it, just search. You can search on YouTube, ClashCon Attendee Gaddy, and you're going to find it. That's going to be probably the first video on your search. And if can, can I make more of them? I don't know if there's gonna be an interesting subject. I can definitely make one. It's 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 really funny for me doing that as well. Is it hard making them? I don't know. It it took me something like half an hour, maybe an hour, together with the editing and together with thinking about the text. So not a long time. When when you know what you want to talk about, it doesn't take a long time but you gotta have some subjects i don't know if i'm gonna do more of them hopefully i'm gonna have some funny subject and i can definitely do another one it was really fun doing that and i've got a lot of good feedback on that video so that's gonna be funny it's 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 pretty interesting how supercell stuff and workers responded to that video i'm pretty sure someone sent that that to them and it, it could be interesting if, if they made a video showing their, how they watch that video for the first time. So that's going to be a very interesting one. And they didn't do that, but I'm sure that they've seen that and no idea what they think about it. Maybe they didn't like it. Who knows? Anyway, it doesn't matter. So can you try posting more anti three star bases on your base beat page? So again, the same one. I'm doing the best I can to add more bases, more attacks on the same basis, more attacks with different heroes, different troops, different defenses, whatever. I'm trying to do my best on this one and that's that's definitely going to continue. So which troop do you use the most? So for Clan Wars, I used Valks a bit. I usually do Gola Loon attacks and stuff like that, sometimes Hawks as well. So that's basically for clan wars and for farming and stuff like that. I'm doing balloons and minions. You already know my method of getting 100k dark elixir in one day. I'm definitely still using that from time to time and it still works. It's going to work forever probably. I don't know what what's this update is going to bring, but it works like charm and you should try that. There's a video just search on my video 100k dark elixir and you're gonna find how to do that if you're having trouble just let me know in the comments and i'm gonna put a link do you have cancer that's pretty rude asking that and thank god i don't have cancer and i think that that's pretty disrespectful towards people who do have cancer and i don't know this kid is 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 crazy reports spam or abused what am I going to do? Report him? Copyright material? No. Unwanted commercial content or spam hate speech? Well, I'm going to skip on you this time. I'm just going to remove that comment. Remove this comment. And next time you do that, you're getting banned. So, hey Gary, I'm, I'm subscribed since 10k and I can say I'm very satisfied with your content. Keep it up, bro, and good luck on the 30k. So, thank you. No question here, but thanks a lot, man. Gary, how can I encourage my clanmates to step up? E.g. using anti 3 star bases, telling telling that anti 2 star bases doesn't make any sense. Get rid of go wipe attacks, aim for 2 star troops composition and encourage them to hardcore clan wars mentality. So I'm gonna I'm gonna answer the first part of this one. You cannot ask people I mean you can, but I cannot guarantee that they're going to do that. Some people are just not hardcore warriors. 
they don't have the time for that they they don't like the game that much they don't want to i don't know for various reasons people are not hard, hardcore warriors and that's definitely most of the clash of clans community most of them are not hardcore warriors i mean look at at clan wars you can see that there are many farm farming clans that every clan can beat in wars because they don't put any effort to wars so if you are in such a clan so let's l read the rest i hate mediocrity mediocrity i'm pretty bad at reading in the english you guys gotta gotta ask some easy questions you know not once that i'm having troubles reading like a five years old so on the things that i love should i share my knowledge about the meta but they don't listen care or should i leave my current clan i think that that's definitely the best thing to do if if the clan if most of the clan or all of the clan doesn't doesn't i don't know how to call it if it doesn't fit your needs just leave and and, and join some other clan there are so many great clans with with i don't, I don't know what you call it hardcore warriors and they like wars that's all they do and if you don't feel well i know you got mates in the clan you can chat with them on facebook or on any other chat program you can keep in contact sometimes visit them sometimes have a war with them but in general i don't think that you should stay in such a clan and you should find a clan which does fit your needs so yeah that's my opinion about it if you meet our minimum requirements you can join uh, you can join cw bootcamp and test yourself and we're gonna see and if there are people on the other hand if your clan are people who are not good enough they are warriors they want a war they want a three star they are serious then just point them to the channel i'm showing a lot of attacks They're, they will get a lot of ideas they will get a lot of ideas for bases that they can use so that's what i'm doing this this channel exactly for those people for the more experience and less experience exactly for those who want to get better in clan wars who want a three star in their attacks and that's all i can say just point them to the channel and hopefully that helps so where do you live and where are you from and what is your job so i noticed before that there are many asking me where do i live so i'll let you guess that and we will see who who guessed that i made that once and pr people probably said the whole world or something like that it was really funny so i'll let you guess that and you let me know and what's my job i'm i'm working with programming i'm a programmer so that's definitely my job i'm also studying at the same time software engineering and yeah that's basically it so go guess in the comments and let's go to the next one in the current game scene do you think supercell will ever add something better or improve wars for example add tournaments for improving wars i don't know ho hopefully they do i'm gonna be happy if they do that and do you think supercell will ever focus heavier on war plays and not trophy pushers the pushers got a lot of a lot from the last recent update so if i'm if i'm supercell and i want to decide how i'm going as a company i would try probably make as much money as possible and this is what they do most of the people who do wars and and i don't know how you call it hardcore warriors most of them are in a very small bunch of clans i don't know maybe 50 clans even 100 clans i don't know how many exactly that's nothing compared to the farmers there are probably thousands tens of thousands i don't know how many clans there are but a lot more than than wars so supercell do need to care about wars and i would be happy if they do that but i don't know what you say i'm not sure if they're gonna put all of their effort for that because they're probably getting most of their money not from not from warriors but from those farmers so i don't know what you say hopefully they do but i'm not gonna be surprised if they keep the same method that they do now focusing on farmers and not adding much to the war community so that's definitely sad for us for for the guys that love war but 
I don't know what to say. That's that's what I have to say about it. So can I go to Winter Never Came here from <laughs> CW Bootcamp? If you're good enough, you'll get promoted. And congrats, thank you. So what caused the rift at Crystal Warriors? You guys split and I heard Tiger was stepping down as a leader and he left. I don't wanna talk I don't wanna talk about it a lot. I'm not I'm not one who, who's doing who's throwing the, the garbage or throwing the shit outside the house. I don't know how to call it. But there were problems with, with the leader, with him, and this basically ended with all of the clan even even a single one didn't stay over there and he had to make a new clan and step down i don't know if he stepped down i think he was kicked from from the clan i don't know what exactly happened there it it it's it's a, it's an old history it doesn't matter anymore we're running three clans right now as you heard in the beginning of the video and it doesn't matter so i know that people like hearing interesting stories but there were no interesting stories over there basically the leaders told him that he gotta step down or we're gonna leave the clan he didn't want to step down and we didn't like his kind of leadership in the clan and we just left and since then we're doing we're doing amazing not much i, I can say about it so can you show us more lava lunion go laloon attacks like in the beginning of your channel congrats you deserve it and sorry for my english and french sorry so sorry for my english as well my english is horrible but if you compare it probably to the first videos that i was making you will you will probably see a lot of change first of all my english got a lot better by doing those videos so if you want to improve your english just open a youtube channel and start making videos it's it's gonna help amazingly just go just go a year ago and check my videos you're gonna see a huge difference in, in the way I'm speaking and vocabulary and everything so sorry you're hairy women blah 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 that doesn't matter remove this comment and what else please keep your thoughts to yourself that that's definitely what I think I removed that comment and I'm just I'm just gonna keep this one so am I gonna show more Lava Luna and Golo Luna attacks definitely I have more and it's pretty hard it's pretty hard deciding which attacks I'm going to do let's say I can make one video a day it's so hard deciding what I want to do there are so many episodes that I can do live attacks Valkyrie attacks Lava Luna attacks I don't know Hulk attacks one hero attacks war recaps of of the clans that we have we have three clans showing attacks from your bindle low heroes internet bases there are so many things that i have to show but i cannot make that many videos so it takes time it's sometimes you gotta wait for your days for for your favorite attacks and i really don't expect everyone to like all of the videos i know some do but i know some like Gola Loon attacks only or Hog attacks only, stuff like that. So I'm doing the best I can to satisfy everyone. I know that it's not possible satisfying everyone all the time, but I'm doing my best showing all the types of attacks for Town Hall 8, for Town Hall 9, mm -hmm. for Town Hall 10 with all the types of, I don't know, every everything I can, I'm showing you guys. I'm doing my best and I'm going to try to do more. And if you got... If you got requests like like this one just just drop a comment under any youtube videos i'm reading all of the comments that you're posting and i'm gonna read your comments as well and if i can do that i'm gonna do if you guys remember i was asking a lot of time ago i was asked for low heroes attacks and notice how many videos of low heroes i posted since then so i think that i'm a youtuber that do listen to his subscribers to his followers and i'm definitely doing my best in continuing that so when is the clash of clans update coming out today the sneak peeks are gonna are gonna start that's gonna be two weeks so just check two weeks from now today is monday so monday in two weeks i guess so next question oh my god that's gonna be a super long one I'm maxing my queen, actually level 35, farming Dark Elixir in Masters 2 and Masters 1 with 
GBART strategy and making around 20k a day. Do you think it's better to farm with cheaper and faster army and farm in other league? <coughs> <coughs> So, I think that Masters is great, and as I said, my method is sniping town halls and stuff like that. You, you're you not spending a lot of troops for that, and I'm getting a lot more than, than 20k Dark Elixir in a day. Like, five times more sometimes. So, just check the video that I was talking about, and you will see. It's more legal. I don't support any any modding talks on on my channel. I don't like it. It doesn't it doesn't get you anywhere, and it's it's a bit out of control. I already talked about it in, in one of the video that was one time exception. I'm not I'm not talking about any modding in the clan. I don't want to deal with it. the The reason I'm having I'm I'm making this channel and making videos is to help you guys do three star attacks. In the legal way, is it legal or not? I don't know. If you call the police and say and 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 say that your friend is modding, they're probably not going to come. So I guess it's legal. I don't know. I don't know how how to answer this one. I mean, it's legal regarding the laws and, and stuff like that. I I guess that Supercell don't like it, and many many people, including me, don't like that as well. But it's legal, I guess. I don't know. I don't know if someone is gonna is is gonna stop that. I guess. I guess basically it's it's if 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 a company makes some program and it has a bad code and and people are 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 using the fact that there's a it's a bad code and and are doing stuff to harm that program let's let's put it this way whose fault is that uh, what are they going to do call the police that that company that made that program they cannot do anything all they can do is fix their their program so basically supercell got to got to put the effort the engineers the time and the money to make an end for it i don't know if they if they can make an end for it because they probably didn't expect it and made the code in 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 some way so it's gonna take them probably a lot of time and a lot of money and a lot of a lot of people working on that and they will have to probably reprogram the whole the whole application the whole game so they're probably thinking I mean, come on, we're earning a lot of money now. Why changing that? Why starting spending so much money? I mean, they're still earning money. So I don't know if they care about it, if they're doing a lot of effort, if they're doing small effort. I'm sure it, it can be fixed, but it's not only for Clash of Clans. A lot of games are are broken as well. And... That, that's how they wrote the code. They wrote it in a way that, that people can break it pretty easily. So this is what people done and this is this is what it, what it became. So I, I don't think that you can expect people playing the game to, to stop that. I mean, not only you can expect, they cannot do it. Uh, so many people are using those modes, in, including in clans that claim fair play. And it's pretty known that that it happens and it exists in every clan and it's almost impossible checking that unless someone is doing really stupid attacks revealing that it's impossible checking that and I don't know what can be done about it I'm, I'm definitely against any kind of cheating I'm not doing that myself but on the other hand that's about the game about the channel I don't want to deal with it I'm, I'm doing I'm doing those those videos just so you guys enjoy them and so you can triple there's a mosquito flying next to me so i'm gonna try and kill it while while i'm talking to you guys i don't know if i can do that hopefully i'm gonna get it so give me a second i'm, I'm i don't want to turn turn off the video it's it's already long enough so let's catch this mosquito and got it, it it's that so enough no no free meals today on me he probably wanted to use the fact that I'm doing a video and and get me, so that's not gonna happen today. 
so let's go to the next questions I don't know how long this video is already I'm not I'm not even counting Gary which hero is better to upgrade first to level 30 at Town Hall 9 King or Queen and why I think that now that many people are using Queen walks and it's very popular and it's very effective I think that definitely the Queen before the King and now you can use Valkyries in the kill squad as well and you can do you can do a lot of damage with them and the king so you don't need to rush your king i would say the queen next questions what made you start playing clash of clans so what caused you to start making videos about it so i i really don't remember why i started playing it just was just was just installing different games and i really like this one and this this is the only one i'm playing right now regarding mobile games and what caused me to start making videos so back in town hall 8 i was pretty good in the game i was three star in town hall 8 it was more than a year ago maybe one and a half years ago and i was pretty good and i wanted to help my clan because we wanted to win wars and it was pretty hard explaining each one about this attack and this attack how you do that so i started making videos for the clan and with explanations and they were watching them and it helped them getting three stars it was back in town hall 8 and <clears throat> and since then a lot of people started watching them i was making guides and stuff like that and you see where i am right now so it started as helping my clan mates and I know that many small youtubers do that still do that and I don't know it just exploded in this way I didn't I really didn't expect that I never thought that one day I'm gonna celebrate 3k subscribers 5 million views and I didn't even think about something like that it's it's crazy it's it's really crazy so next question Early congrats on 30k. If you were Supercell CEO for one day and could implement three permanent changes, what would they be? Oh god, that's that's a tough question. What do I want to see in the game? So definitely Clan Wars tournaments. That's definitely if if it was if it was easier to make a match with another clan without all those troubles of weights and stuff like that and search in the same time just something that they can make and 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 make it fair like same same weight i don't know if how it's going to work maybe a tournament where people are getting not their bases but they're getting the same stuff the same stuff and and both clans are equal so players are choose which one they want to play the level 25 heroes the level 30 heroes stuff like that even if it's not a real base and they can work with that so that that could be something interesting another another thing that i think will actually end up all those modding and stuff like that i think that supercell should add that function of practicing attacks and and whatever modders do they should add it add that as built in in the in the game if they add that and it's legal and everyone can do that and it's it's it becomes fair then those mods are gonna disappear no one is gonna use them because they can have that inside the game all they have to do is balance the game a bit make town hall nines three stars much harder make i don't know all they have to do is balance it so even among the ones that are practicing you will be able to see the differences between the warriors and i think that this is definitely something that can be done and this is probably maybe the easier choice to end up all the cheating and all those stuff so that's my opinion about it so that that was two things and i owe you another one so what else do i want to see permanent changes i don't know i'm not sure 
I think that the game is, is is pretty good. I don't know what else what else can be done. So let's leave it with two stuff. If I'm gonna think about something during 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 those questions, I'm gonna answer the the another one. So when did you decide becoming a YouTuber? I don't know, something like a year ago, maybe a bit more. I, I just talked about it. And will you put more Town Hall 10 contents in the future? Definitely, whenever I see interesting Town Hall 10 attacks, I'm adding them and more are going to be coming, definitely. So if you got Town Hall 10 friends, you should definitely invite them to, your, to the channel. What's your attack strategy? You already know I like balloons a lot and Lava Hounds. That's definitely my favorite. I know you have a lot on how to scout videos, but with all the changes, New Speller, Sweeper, Archer Queen walk and with more experience under your own belt, how do you plan an attack against any base? So that's something I'm talking about in a lot of the videos. And you gotta plan a few stuff. First of all, you gotta decide which type of attack you wanna do. Look at the air defenses, look at the bombs location. And if the bombs locations are very easy, most likely you wanna do a hog attack. If the air defenses are very easy, most likely you want to do an air attack. So that's very shortly. If you watch the videos, I'm definitely explaining how to scout a base. And I'm going to try doing that in almost every video that I'm posting. A few words before, be before showing the plan and before showing the attack, I'm going to show you guys why this kind of attack was chosen for this kind of basis. Some things are hard to explain and, and it still somehow works. Some, some attacks are lucky ones. I'm trying not to show that, those because I don't want to, I don't I don't want you guys to, to make attack based on luck. I want you to guys make attack that attacks that are most likely going to work and you know it's gonna work because you're doing the right thing on the right base. So there, 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 there are few elements of an attack. You gotta do the right attack on the right base with the right execution. So if you do that, most likely you're gonna three star. So also, if there are more than one way to attack a base, what strategy is the safest? I don't know what's what's safest. I know that if it's a fresh attack, you wanna bring a, a, a pretty big kill squad with Valkyries. Usually Valk attacks are very stable, even against fresh attacks where you don't know the Tesla locations and the bombs locations. And I think that Hogs are not safe for a first attack because if you don't know the bombs location and there are many locations and y you have no idea most likely the attack is gonna fail. It's very risky using hogs unless you know the bombs locations. So that's my opinion. So what's safest? I don't know, probably Valk attacks. That's what I think. So also, what are your thoughts about Gowiwi and Gowipe, including backend hog loons? There are a lot of people who do three stars with this strategy. And that's true. People started using balloons and hogs and stuff like that. And many of the bases are very easy to beat with Gowiwi or Gowipe with with some backend hogs and loons and I used to show those attacks, not many are using them, I do use them from time to time when I'm actually playing and that's not a lot but you're totally right, people are making bases that are gonna hold well against Gowiwi and Gowipe which are gonna hold well against air attacks and hog attacks and stuff like that and eventually you find out that those bases are very very vulnerable to go away and go wipe so that's something funny and i think that more people should use that is it's definitely it's definitely possible three starting with it especially all those open up bases with large compartments and many use that in big clan wars so that's definitely something possible but some people see that as, as as a humiliation or something funny using those kinds of attacks because they're they're there are two star attacks, some people say, but I don't know, it's it's definitely possible using them. I, I definitely agree with you. So if you're using them and if you're good with them, just let me know. I'm gonna come to your clan and record those three star attacks. So please upload more low heroes like level 10 heroes, go hog, lalu, shatter, laloon, blah blah blah, level one, lavas. I don't know where I'm gonna get level one while lavas. Come on man. I don't know if anyone's still using them. But I don't know if I'm gonna see some. If someone posts on Bindle, 
that's great i'm gonna come and record that i i don't mind i don't mind if even if someone attacks the max town hall 9 base with wall breakers and goblins and somehow he gets the three star i don't care i'm gonna come and record that if he gets the three star then it's good i don't mind but level one lavas i don't know i think it's gonna be pretty hard that's my own opinion but maybe possible if if someone posts it then i'm definitely gonna show you that so thanks it really helps me becoming the best attacker in my clan keep up the good work thank you for supporting thank you for your comment let's go to the next one are you jamming to town hall 11 definitely not i like town hall 9 and i not even town hall 10 as as said over here so definitely not congrats you deserve more thank you you make the game more fun with all the strategies son i don't know my question I guess it's some some of my questions are where are you from and what's your favorite troop strategy so i've spoken about it in the beginning of the video just you probably you probably heard it so let's go to the next one what do you rate your girlfriend out of 10 <laughs> probably a nine i don't know a nine or a ten something like that hopefully she's not watching those videos so why didn't you say a ten of course I'm a 10. No, just kidding. She's a 10, definitely a 10. I mean, I don't want to sleep on the on the on the sofa later, so definitely a 10. So, how was Tiger as a leader? I already said that. And answer that. Can you do live cam videos so we can see what you look like? I did show myself in photos and maybe some videos as well. I don't remember already. Yeah, I did a video in Prague as well and i showed my face so definitely go check those videos and and you're gonna see that if you want my photos I'm, i can definitely send on bindle if you that want them i i don't like all those face cam and, and stuff like that during video it's, it's just weird and i don't I, I i'm not sure if i want people looking at me while i'm making a video i don't know if you think i should do that just let me know let's see how many ask for that if if a lot of people are gonna ask for that i can definitely definitely do that but i don't know i'm not i'm not a, f a big fan of those so can you show go hog attacks on popular town hall 9 bases and failing with hogs deployment my heroes are still low level 15 should i take more than 24 hogs i don't know i can't i cannot answer such questions without seeing a base it depends on the base you're probably not attacking the right base or maybe attacking too high stuff like that so it's really hard answering what i suggest is you join bindle and ask the people over there and they're definitely going to help you there are a lot of people over there and they're hel they're helping each other and it's a nice community so something in spanish i don't know spanish he aprendiendo mucho con gadi saludos desde chile y sigue en este camino I don't know if I read that well. Anyway, someone translate that or something. Where's Google Translate? Hold on. I'm gonna go to Google Translate and see what he says. So I translated that and it says I learned a lot with Gaddy. Probably that's the translation of Gaddy. I don't know. Greetings from Chile and continue in this way. Thanks a lot. Mucho gracias. Por favor. Whatever I know in Spanish those three words probably okay so a lot of questions here how old are you i'm 28 why did you have to ask that i'm feeling old now saying that anyway 28 do you play any other games besides clash i'm i don't really have time right now but i did play some pc games gta 5 and i started playing the witcher 3 if that interests you and on mobile games no not really i'm not playing anything else but i barely have time playing and honestly so do you speak any other languages besides english which ones well that that might reveal where am i from but what i can say is that i can understand and read russian as well is that surprising you we had a clan crazy russian or something like that and they started speaking russian and, and i talked russian to them as well by the way my girlfriend is you is ukrainian so so yeah i can understand russian but you'll have to ask to 
to guess where am I from? So, who first show you how to treat their clanmates? A different YouTuber. Uh, I was actually not watching anyone. Well, there, there were definitely people who Trister in, in the clans that I've been, but I was I was planning and making my Trister on my own. I, I was I was making those strategies and and I don't know. I think I was doing that on my own. Definitely, I was definitely watching people how they do that and tried learning from that and tried making it better and see what went wrong and improving that as well and do you live in the US maybe you'll have to guess that so feel free to reply to this comment to add more questions you have more questions than that come on man you asked five no just kidding you can ask more questions so what's going on on Twitter there there are so many notifications over there and someone and three others like your tweet I, I really don't understand Twitter yet I'm I'm a total noob on, on Twitter. Grats, man. Love your internet basis. Serious. You have helped the community a lot. Keep up the good work. I so appreciate it. You probably don't expect that you're going to be in the videos. That That's pretty funny. So, thank you, sir. Really appreciate that. How long is this video already? I, I don't know when I, when I started that. It's so, so long. I hope Hopefully, it's 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 actually entertaining for you guys. I don't know just let me know if you got bored just let me know and you can let me know there's nothing I can do I, I continue with the video so you'll have to cut you, you had you you'll have to cut the watching or something like that I don't know so someone with a Putin with sunglasses is it sunglasses I don't know what's that anyway someone very serious over here more town hall more t8 strategies and episode testing new strategies well hopefully hopefully i'm gonna be posting more i'm gonna do my best hey bro do you practice any sport i really like playing basketball and yeah i'm, I'm playing that sometimes when i have time so what do you prefer go hogo go laloon definitely go laloon congrats gary please make a video on the current meta for anti trister basis I have no idea what are you talking about. What what do you mean by meta? So you're 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 definitely going to end to post a comment and explaining your questions because I, I don't really understand the, this question. So what is the theme you use in the intro video? Where did you get the video used in the masterpiece in your masterpiece exclusive interview with Clash Con attendee? So the theme I'm using, I actually made it myself with a program called, I think it's called Blender. And you can definitely learn it a bit. It's a bit complicated. It's a graphic program, but I made it myself. And it's pretty nice. There, there are tutorials of how to use it, so you can definitely do that yourself as well. And that masterpiece I don't know I just found it on the internet it looked really funny so I decided using that I don't know what what's the where it came from or stuff like that I know that many people posted that are you from Serbia who knows maybe how was your journey journey where you'll have to explain that I mean I've been on a vacation if you mean that it, it was nice so will you do more live attacks whenever i'm doing a war i'm gonna do live attacks i'll definitely do i just don't have a lot of time to war i'm already making this video for i don't know how long already so it takes all of my time you used to do them a good amount back in the Lavaloon days definitely i was playing a lot more back then but i haven't seen many reasons there are two recent ones a few days ago i made two live attacks go check that definitely go check that I know they're never wrecking, but you know it will be like the old days. I definitely agree with you. I'll do my best to to do that. So that question was posted twice accidentally. Never mind, it's all good. Who's your favorite clashers with IY in their name? Oh, I know who you are. You bastard. Where are you right now? Sitting in your old clan? This guy is 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 a mega Trister attacker in Town Hall 9 and I don't know maybe he became a Town Hall 10 meanwhile and he's not coming to our, to our clan that that you're not my favorite only if you're in my clan you're my favorite remember that so 
Why did you? Why did so many of you leave Crystal Crystal Warriors? I already spoken about it. This video is gonna is gonna be three hours if I'm if I'm gonna do that again. I subscribe when you have 500 subs. That that's amazing. Thank you, man. The only way I licked licked in your video. Why are you licking in my video? That that that's a bit pervy. Is your explanation? It looks that you're a college professor teaching us how to do attacks. I, I was actually teaching high school high school students math. So yeah, that's definitely the favorite my, one of my, why one one of my favorite things to do teaching stuff, and that's definitely one of the reasons that I started this YouTube channel. Thank you, Gary, for giving such good videos. Thank you. We all love you. I love you, all of you, each one of you. And keep up the good work. Thank you for your kind words. And same by Furkan. Thanks a lot, guys. What do you think about the Town Hall 11 update? It's it's really hard to say. I'm I'm definitely gonna give my thoughts. The sneak peeks are gonna are gonna start today. So I'll definitely give my thoughts when there, there there's gonna be something that I can talk about. I don't know what's gonna happen in Town Hall 11. No idea. It's, it's they just say there's gonna be Town Hall 11, new hero, new defense. No idea what this hero looks like or what it does. So it's really hard answering that. And that question was posted twice as well. Congrats. What's the minimum level Archer Queen for doing Walking Queen Super Queen? Go, go Valk. With V, good. What? What? Anyway, I'm gonna answer the the first question since I don't understand the second one. I think that level 20 is 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 a good point of starting queen walk attacks, and I definitely posted videos of someone doing that with level 12 and with level 15. But that's not optimal. That queen dies very fast, and those healers are not fast enough heal it. So I definitely think that level 20 is good enough if you're a supercell developer and had a choice to add three things to the game in an upcoming that was asked i answered that i definitely answered that even though you posted the same question twice i already answered that where are you from and i already said just guess people are guessing places get is from israel tran he's probably from norway because in his old video he showed replay the attacker was written something something which means well attack <laughs> that's a funny guy anyway next one okay Gary, i got a question really what are you doing over here no just kidding that's the place to ask the questions what hero do you think is more beneficial to upgrade i already answered that definitely the queen we're gonna see what happens in the current update if you were leader of clan Tiger was in. What would you what <laughs> you type in the kick in, in the kick message? I don't know. Just what the clan the Clash of Clans stuff say. I don't know. I don't want to say any bad words over here. That that's an educational video and kids are watching it, so I'm definitely not gonna do that. Anyway, how would you up your heroes? For example, level 16, level 20 queen. I'm thinking to bring the king to 25 and then the queen to 30. What? what you do differently i think that first of all bring both heroes to, to level 20 and then just upgrade the queen to level 30 that's my opinion i'd also like to hear more about the inside of hardcore work clans plus if you had the part to decide three things on the next update what would you do so answer the thing about the three things i wonder why people choose three things and not two things or four things or six things i i just had two things in mind I don't know if, if if there's something else that I want to see. And what do you want to hear about the inside of hardcore of hardcore worklands? Just ask questions, something specific, so I can answer. I, I don't know how to answer this one. So congrats, Hermano. What is Hermano? No idea. By the way, can you show more how the queen plus heroes attack strategy at Town Hall 9? I want to learn it. Definitely, I'm gonna do my best showing more of those. I heard someone that I guess showing his apps. What? <laughs> what the hell? Why are you asking me? Go ask him. And gaming. Oh, and congrats. Well, I don't know what you're talking about, man. Anyway, 
What are you playing apart from Clash of Clans? Answer that. Do you sometimes think back about the clan splitting for Star Wars and feel why are you guys dealing with something that happened so long ago? I already forgot that I've been a Crystal Warrior. We are in our new life and you're like guys talking about their ex-girlfriend. Forget about her. She broke up with you. You broke up with her. It happens. Just go on. What's the point dealing with that again? Anyway, also after the split... Did you and Nagami talk to each other at all? No, we haven't talked to each other at all. Always like both channel content. The same, so curious. What? Well, what can I do? It happens. And... I don't know, hopefully it's not gonna affect your life. Knowing that we're separated now. And just kidding, come on, it's, it's not a big deal. What is your and your girlfriend's name? I don't know if she's gonna like me telling you any names and stuff like that. Well, my name is definitely Gary. I don't know. I don't know if I want to say her name. She's gonna get mad at me. She got a nice name though. Definitely a nice one. So, will you guys rejoin Crystal Warrior? We we've spoken about it a few weeks ago, and seems like the guys are 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 okay, are fine with the current state, and they don't want to go back there, even though the the leader was not there anymore. So I guess we're gonna stay at the same state. So I'm a, a max town hall nine, max group, max troops, enemy setup, anti three star base and spread explodes on layer one. Queen is protected by two cannons and one arch tower and double. Oh my god, that's a long way. Is it worth or necessary to kill the queen first or just queen walk other side? Well, if you're not gonna kill the queen who's gonna do that hogs are not gonna do that most likely balloons are not gonna do that you gotta kill the queen i mean i'm not saying go directly at her some attacks are going from the other side of the base and are getting to the queen eventually as well so you definitely have to kill the queen or she's gonna do a lot of damage to your hogs and to your balloons so that's about it what would your greatest advice be on starting a winning war clan from scratch well, that's that's what we we've done with CW Bootcamp. If you go to it, even though it's a clan made from scratch with totally new people, and not only that, every war a lot of people are are kicked from the clan and new people join, and it still wins most of their wars. So you can call it a winning war clan. It 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 happens. So what's my advice? Have a YouTube channel and people wanting to join you. That, that there, there isn't much I can say about it. It's very hard making a, a winning war clan from scratch. It's really hard. What I recommend for someone who doesn't have a YouTube channel, and it definitely helps recruiting, having a YouTube channel, because a lot of people want to wanna join us, and it's definitely a good thing for us, and we're happy that you guys want to join us, but... I would say just join a good clan and make it better, help the guys there, do good attacks, and I think it's going to be better than making a war clan out, out of nowhere. I mean, where where are you going to recruit the people on global? It's, it's going to be very tough. By the way, I want, I want to start a new series of episodes of me leaving a clan and going to global and asking for a clan and see how people, how people react and see clans from global what it looks like are they nice maybe i'm gonna i'm gonna see some good clans as well let me know in the comments if you think that i should do those episodes and i think i'm gonna do them it's it's definitely something interesting so keep up the good work your videos are very educated thank you where are you from already answered something in arabic i'll have to translate that with google translate so be right back so this is the translation congratulations to 30,000 subscribers thank you i am one of those who follow the channel since 16,000. thanks a lot that that's that's a long way about about twice less follow your wonderful i guess wonderful channel or something thanks a lot man i, I really appreciate your comments even though i had to use google translate for that i i really appreciate that my throat hurts 
So, as a middle level clan, we don't attract a lot of sponsor seasoned attackers and have to train a lot of beginners. Some commercial tutor clan, what do you think are the most effective teaching methods besides going watch this YouTube or that YouTuber or watch war attacks? So, first of all, watch attacks and then go practice it yourself. Do those attacks, see what works, what doesn't. Sometimes I'm not saying totally everything and people are missing stuff, so definitely. A lot of practice it takes time but it's gonna be worth it how long have you have you played clash of clans no idea maybe two three years i don't know seriously don't know where you are from we already talked about it how did you start with youtube also talk about it i'm starting to not feel my tongue and i might go to the hospital after this video so when are you gonna upgrade your town hall from 9 to 10? Probably not not soon. And why doesn't people who have fully maxed town hall now upgrade into town hall? I think that town hall 10 is very unbalanced and a lot of people are afraid from that. And town hall 9 is pretty fun. I think it's the is the most fun town hall in the game. And yeah, that that's what I think. That's why people are not going to town hall 10. How is your pronunciation so swag I don't know what he's saying that that that's too high level English for me hold on I'm gonna translate that I'm using Google Translate for 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 too many times in this video well Google Translate didn't help me with that so I don't know please explain what what you what you mean I don't know what do you want to change at Clash of Clans if you could already talked about it? Hey Gary, congratulations on reaching this milestone. Thank you. If you're a supercell, what are the things you're gonna improve about the balancing at Town Hall 10? It's it's really hard answering that because I'm not I'm not really sure what's the problem with Town Hall 10 that it's so hard. They they just added so many stuff on it and it's pretty hard getting three stars on town hall 10 it's very hard getting three stars on town hall 10 unless you're very very creative and doing a perfect execution so i think that they, they should lower the let's call it the level of difficulty of getting three stars at town hall 10 i mean maybe they don't want people to get a lot of three stars in town hall 10 that's definitely something possible but i think that this this should bar balance the game a bit are you a gay bro no i'm not gay by the way congrats for 30k subscribers thank you i'm looking to migrate <laughs> what is your suggestion i don't know where you're living you didn't tell me where if you're living in i don't know i don't know that that's a weird question to ask me i'm not i'm not migrating every every week or something like that i haven't been everywhere but I can tell you from my vacations, the places I've been there are nice. I don't know. So, O, o and you looking to recruit people for your YouTube channel? What do you mean? Not sure about these questions. So, let's go to the next one. Best strategy for Town Hall 10. Definitely air attacks and queen walk attacks. Though those, are, those are definitely the best. And I've seen hog attacks as well in Town Hall 10. Why do you cheat? I don't cheat. Can you provide more Town Hall 9 vs Town Hall 10 videos? Whenever I'll have something interesting, I'll definitely share that. What's your job? Where are you studying? What are you studying? So I said that, and I'm gonna say again, I'm, I'm programming, studying software, software engineering, and computer science, if we, we can call it this way. Get HH in, in GS96 and other high level work clans are almost now Town Hall 9, three stars, cleanup attacks, or first attacks. So most of, of our three stars are first attacks. So probably 60, sometimes 70%, sometimes 50%. It depends on the basis. But even in, in Tough Wars, most of the Town Hall 9 attacks are fresh attacks, are, are first attacks on, on basis. I'll definitely try showing that in, in one of the videos. So definitely fresh attacks. People are very talented and they're doing fresh attacks with very high success rate sometimes they fail of course many times they fail but but the success rate on first attack is pretty high 
can I have your Clash accounts? Definitely go come and take it. Are you Egyptian? Who knows, maybe? How many languages do, do you speak? So I'm speaking three languages. Where are you from? Already talk about it. Face reveal. I did that and already talked that about it in the video. Keep up the good work. Thank you. Would you either use dark troops and dark elixir spells or elixir troops for the rest of the of of your clash clash of clans career? I mean, why does it matter? I'm gonna do whatever I can to three star. Doesn't matter if it's dark if it's dark or not dark. I mean, we don't want to be racist over here, so it doesn't really matter. Where are you from? Talk about how did you get into three star strats? By the way, your videos are excellent. So. I think I answered that during the video. I want to answer those few questions that are asked. My throat is dead. It's, it's totally dead. Can you break down Tarhol 10 attacks and do in-depth tutorials? Will definitely do my, do my best. I did some in the past, so just go check them. Where to use earthquake spells rather than jump? It's definitely regard. It's definitely about the timing. If you think that it's gonna take your troops, your queen, your your king, whatever, it's gonna take time to reach that that jump spell, it, and it might disappear. You wanna consider using an earthquake spells. Apart from that, they're doing pretty much the same. What's the minimum level? Do you think the archer queen walk is effective? As I said, level 20. Are you Egyptian? Who knows? Maybe I am. You'll have to guess that. So yeah, that that's about it. So now I'm gonna do the giveaway, and for that, that's gonna be for my bundle user. So what I'm gonna do is start generating some letters, and we will go to the bundle chat users. If you wanna get updated, if I'm doing any giveaways or stuff like that, I'm usually posting on Twitter. So go go on twitter and follow me and you're gonna you're you you will be able to follow that so there's a russian guy saying thanks 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 a lot for for a great video and and best best wishes or, or best of luck so told you i can read russian so this is what he's saying thanks a lot alexander Thanks a lot. I appreciate that. And yeah, what I wanted to do. So I'm going to do the giveaway. The rules are very simple. I have one iTunes card, one Google Play card. I'm going to pick two people. And first one will have the first priority to choose the card he wants. And second one will get the other card if he wants it. What you have to do, you must contact me. In the next, let's say, 48 hours, 72 hours on Bendel, you got to claim that card. If that's you on the list, if you're still there, you got to claim that card. If you left and then joined and it still shows you stuff like that, that doesn't count. I'm going to do the giveaway. If I'm left with cards, I'm going to do the giveaway again. So what I'm going to do is draw a letter. Let's start with, let's stop you. So we're going to go. To bindle the, this is what it looks like it got almost 2,000 people already on the chat and they're helping each other so I'll have to scroll down to the letter U that that's gonna take a, a length of another video probably come on bindle guys you you gotta make a way finding users I'm only on B that's gonna take a long time so I'm gonna do that and come back to you when when that happens so this is the letter U. The, those are the guys who start with the letter U. So I'm going to generate the second one. And that's going to be the letter E. Let's see if we got UE. UE. We don't have someone with UE. Let's generate again a second late letter. That's going to be V. UV, UV, UV. Do we have someone with UV? I don't know. I don't know. No. No UV. Let's generate again. UU definitely I don't think we have a UU right just want to make sure no so again UL UL do we have that no again UR UR yes we have two UR so that's gonna be I or K I or K that's gonna be the winner so the first one we have I or K and 
let's see if we have that I or K let's see which one comes first come on come on hopefully I'm not gonna miss that letter I so the first one is I so the winner of the card is Yuri eight two zero contact me on Bendel tag me and you're gonna get the card just let me know which one you want a Google Play card or an iTunes card by the way those cards can be used in USA only so if you're not from the USA you can give it out to your friends or whatever you want someone to your clan if you if you don't want it just let me know I'm gonna do the giveaway again so that was the first one it was Yuri 8 H20 and let's go and generate again a first letter and let's stop now F so I'm gonna start going up to F I think that going up as is much faster so at least that so let's go to the word to the to the letter F oh my god I'm still in N did so slow come on let's go let's go F L K I'm getting close to F J come on let's go to F probably have more than one with F no 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 don't kick anyone so F F F F F I'm effing so much in this video G the, there we go F so let's generate the second one that's gonna be P F P do we have F P I see F U F R F O no F P let's generate second letter again F A let's go up and find F A F A we have a couple of those so we will have to generate the third letter F A L do we have that F A L no right we don't have F A L F A L no F A L third letter again F A T no F A T as well third letter F A Y F A Y yes we have F A Y Fai Fais is the winner of the second car so you will have to wait for the first card winner unless he doesn't respond in the next few days on Bindle and you're gonna be the winner of the second card and yeah that's basically it so I hope you like it I know the video was long something like an hour long probably maybe probably a bit less but my throat is dead it's totally dead hope you like it if you did like subscribe and comment don't forget bringing your clan mates to the channel and keep up spreading the word and showing your support I really appreciate you guys you are amazing each one of you and that's it we'll see each other in the next video bye bye